Welcome to another episode of Timmy Talks in Chandelar. For the next 45 minutes, we're going to dive into the world of Chandelar again. Let me start the launcher. Oh, Chandelar! I love that opening tune. It's cool, man. It gives me the good vibes. There we go. Let me turn down the volume a little bit. Gonna go into load saved game, Tim the Enchanta. Now there is a little confession I have to make because this is actually episode eight and a half. Now let me explain why. Don't worry, um, I was playing, I did save the campaign, but the recording didn't work out. Like the, the sound was wrong, there were glitches. It just was horrible. So with the pain in my heart, I had to delete that video and make a new episode eight, but like I said, I saved the game already, so I just want to get you up to speed. Because basically what happened is, I went into, into the White Castle for the first time. I got my ass kicked. Like, absolutely. It was a slaughter fest. I mean, there are some strong dudes in there. And also along the way, I lost some valuable cards. But I also won a second copy of this card, Time Walk. So that is like insane. And since I got my ass kicked, I made a decision. I thought, you know what? It was my initial idea to only play with, you know, one copy of every restricted card and one copy of like Contract From Below and stuff, but I've decided to join the dark side. I mean, it's just too tough. I need these cards and it's also kind of cool to play with two time locks, you know? When do you ever do that? Like never, only in Chandelar. So I changed my mind and I'm also playing with two Contracts From Below in this deck. Um, I also found a Gloom along the way. So hopefully it's gonna help me. Anyway, now that you're up to speed, um, I'm really looking forward to this episode because I'm gonna go into the White Castle and I wanna, I wanna kick his butt, you know? We need to free these poor people of Chandelar and I don't wanna lose this game. So this is the card, we're here at the temple. Got the Blue Castle, got the White Castle. I'm actually closer to the Blue Castle, but I'm gonna go for the White Castle first because I've got like specific cards. I feel like I'm better prepared this time. Let's see, trade black amulets for blue cards. Hmm. Only have one black amulet, so maybe it's good to kind of wait. Hmm. Look, this is an expensive place. Buy 10 food for 20 gold. That's quite expensive, so maybe I can sell some cards here. If I have cards left. Hmm, birds of paradise. Let's see what I have. Some white cards I can sell, okay. Okay, morale for 95. Wall of light, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna play white here. Ooh, 240, that was a good price. Got a lot of money. Conjurer's will, travel east to Hornwall Tower, okay. No, I don't wanna battle against you. Oh, no, I don't wanna battle against you either. Just wanna go to the white castle, leave me alone. Defeat the Merfolk Shaman with one blue amulet. Maybe later, not now. Ank of Mishra. That's Ank of Mishra is a nasty card. Shall I buy an Ank? You can build some nasty decks, you know, sinkholes and stuff like that. I can do like a land removal deck. I'm not gonna, I'm not, maybe later, maybe later. I gotta get, gotta focus. Focus on the task at hand. Go away, Fungus Monster. Duel the master, okay. Let's duel, right? I mean, we do need to kind of, you know, get into it again, so. We're gonna duel. So I've got an island, a swamp, a s island, swamp, control magic, a disc, and a drudge, okay. And there's already a contract from below, sweet. I'm feeling good about this. I mean, Wall of Root, who cares? I'm just gonna play out some lands, try to empty my hand as quickly as I can, then play the contract from below and get some new cards. You know what? I'm gonna attack. Maybe he's gonna do something stupid. You never know. Or maybe not. Uh, play another Swamp. It's past the turn. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. What is this? Of course, the Fungusaur, Fungus Master. I really like Fungusaur and the Timmy. 
I could steal this fungus sword. That would be funny. I'm going to wait. Let me play the disc. I'm just going to wait. Maybe he's going to make his fungus sword really big and then I'll steal it. That's my secret plan. Ooh, an iron root tree folk. Ooh, there's a time walk. This is the thing, like my hand is so good right now, I just don't know what to steal. I could also use an Evanerals disc. You know what, I'm gonna do that, I think. I'm gonna use the disc, why not? I'm gonna regenerate the drudge, there we go. And then I'm gonna take an extra turn. Ooh. Life is good if you're playing in a deck with multiple time walks. I could get used to this. I still feel kind of evil about it, but you know, I need to save the people of Chandelar, right? I need to do what's, what's best for them. It's not about me, it's about the people of Chandelar, right? Ah, unsummon. That is good, Fungus Master, that is good. Ooh, a plant. That is annoying, I need to get my flyers. City of Brass, um, a Drain Life, we could play a Drain Life. Uh, let's play a Drudge. Shall I steal the plant? You know what, I'm gonna steal the plant. The reason is that I kind of want to empty my hand to play the contract, so... And now at least I can hit him for three, right? Which is good. Change to assembly worker, boom. And hit him for three points, there we go. And I guess I can now play the Dark Ritual. Because I'm going to play a huge drain life, I think. Drain life one and two. Oh, wait, he's taking. Man, sometimes this program is so annoying because now I'm going to get mana burn of one. I mean, it doesn't really matter that much, but still. No, power sink, sweet. That is a good move. At least I don't get mana burn anymore. That was a good power sink, Fungus Master. I've always um, been a little bit surprised that power sink is a common level. You know, if you look at the card, you see what unique stuff the card actually does. I feel it should be uncommon at least. Mm, okay, the gloom is not gonna help me much. Shall I control magic the wall? No, I'm just gonna play contract from below. Why not? Or, okay, I'm gonna steal the wall. Why not? Let's steal. I'm just gonna steal all his walls. It's funny. Ooh! This is annoying. Can I play contract from below? No, I can't. Oh man, this is annoying. Shouldn't underestimate the Fungus Master. I think this is the Power Sink, the Mirage art. Okay, underground C. Let's finally play out the contract. Hopefully he doesn't have a counter spell. Discard the gloom. Ooh, Jin is added to the ante. I really have to win this. Oh, look at this hand. This is awesome. Psionic Blast, Island, Unstable Mutation, Water Elemental, a Tim, a Sengir Vampire. Wow. Uh, I think I'm gonna play the Sengir. Exactly, and then I'm gonna play the unstable on the drudge. I like playing the, the unstable on the drudge because of that regeneration. You really have a strong creature that you can then regenerate as well, so you can use it super aggressively. I wonder if, if the deck's gonna evolve and I'm getting some more like bigger flyers. Maybe I'm gonna try to find a Nettling Imp. I mean, Nettling Imp Sengir, that's like a classic combination, right? Okay, what else do we have? It feels like the match is kind of a done deal here. So we're gonna attack, 
He has to block the drudge, exactly. Could have also, oh man, I should have attacked with the factory. I would have won already. Oh, I've got Sionic Blast. Let's just finish it, shall we? Hey, oh, we're reset. Whenever I see reset, I gotta think stasis straight away. Dark Ritual, remove soul, Batlands, Boomerang, Carnivorous Plant. Take the cards. Ooh, I get a wall of wood in my next duel. Pay 40 gold or duel the Merfolk Shaman. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna pay because I wanna. Let's see, let's go into the village. A mana link and a green amulet. That's pretty good deal. Gold snap forge, where is that? Oh, that's over there. That's near the White Castle. Okay, I could, I could, I could accept the quest. I could do that. A winter, oh, I've been here before, I guess. Cards are gone. Winter Orb, that's a good card. Not gonna buy it though, I gotta be focused. Focus on the task at hand. Finding a planes. No, 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 no. Oh, dang it. You know what, I'll duel the Vampire Lord. Weakness is kind of okay. I can, I can play weakness. Maybe it's good in the White Castle against all the, the weenie decks. Okay, oh, but I don't want to lose the Sionic Blast. Let's see, my hand is not very good. A Swamp, a Factory, Sengir, Counterspell, Unstable, Unsummon, and another Sengir. Hmm, if I can find another land in a Dark Ritual, I can get out of Sengir really quickly. That would be ideal. Okay, it's another Swamp. That's good. You know what? I'm going to animate. I think... A black mana, I mean, I don't have to worry about my assembly worker getting killed. I think this is kind of a free attack. Yeah. Passing the turn. And, ah, oh man, I really want to go into the White Castle. Maybe this is going to be a longer episode. I'm, I'm just saying, maybe. <laughs> it takes so long to kind of get somewhere in this game because you just keep getting attacked by all these minions. It's hysterical. Okay, um, I could go island. Then I have access to unsummon this. I guess island is a good good thing to do. I'm going to tap this and I want to animate this to the assembly worker. And let's attack. So let me know, by the way, in the comments, if you also play Chandelar or maybe started playing Chandelar because you're looking at these series. It can be a little bit tricky to get it working on your laptop. It took me like a day, but once you've got it, it's just so much fun. There's the Mana Vault. Okay. I like the fact that I've got an Unsummon because then if he uses his Mana Vault to cast something big, I can just Unsummon it big, uh, back. Let's see, another Swamp. I've got unstable and unsummon. I guess I'm just gonna attack again. Change to worker. I mean, it would be nice to have like a double blue, so I have counter magic backup, but I'm not unhappy with how this is going. If you remember my opening hand with just two lands, the, the, the factory in the swamp, you know, and I'm finding some more mana, so I can next turn cast the Sengir, hopefully. There's the attack. Ooh, he's not going to pump. Interesting. I've got to... One sec. There we go. Oh, a dark ritual. I just, I just got to put my uh, charger in there. Of course, hey, Sengir. Why not? I'm going to unsummon it anyway. And he's going to lose. Oh, that's awesome. Unsummon. Bye-bye, Sengir. Bye-bye. It was so much fun to have you here. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, this felt good. He lost a life. He's got the mana vault tapped. And his Sengir is back in hand. That was pretty good. Ooh, a weakness to put on the, uh, the bats. I'm not going to do that yet, though. I'm first going to play out my own Sengir. And I've got a second Zangir Vampire, and I have an Unstable Mutation. Ooh. Okay, okay, fair enough. He also has his own weakness. 
Whatever, man. Whatever. Um, I think I'm first going to attack. Just going to see what he does. What are you going to do? Take the damage, sure. Play another Singir. And pass turn. So hopefully next turn I can win. I can put a weakness on the bats and then I can swing in for six. I even have the unstable I can also play. Of course you would tear the wall of wood. Then again, he cannot target the uh, the vampires, right? Because they're, they're black. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Kind of an unfortunate card for him to have. Um, oh yeah, let's play the weakness. There are multiple ways here to win, but I think this is the easiest. The least clicking. I mean, he stepped out, nothing to fear. Hey, great, great, great. Another contract from below. Oh, shall I play with three contracts from below? That is kind of mean, but I am going to do it. You know what? I'm going to do it just before I go into the White Castle. White Wizard sends a Crusader. Snap. Where am I at? Okay, so I'm just going to go to uh, this... A Lauren hole, and I'm just gonna go straight up. There we go. Please don't attack me. Don't do it. I'm just a nice guy. No. Sometimes it feels like my down key is not working. You may buy amulets for 200 gold pieces. Ah, oh, dang it. That is tempting. I'm gonna buy a black one. Mm. Buy a blue one? Okay. And now I'm broke again, by the way. The Tusk Guardian. Sure, we're gonna duel the Tusk Guardian. That's the thing with this game. I get so distracted. I'm like, I want to go into the White Castle, but now I've got a mission. I'm dueling a Tusk Guardian. I'm buying amulets. I'm like, ah. Oh. It's like all over the place. Because I am, I mean, I need to focus or else I'm, I'm really going to lose this game. Mm. Opening hand, by the way. I've got Unstable, Dark Ritual. Ooh, there's a Timberwolves. Contact from below, Time Walk, Island, and City of Brass. Shall I play a contract? No, because I've got the Time Walk 2. I'm just going to wait. I'm just going to wait. I'm on 14. It's good. This is not good. I'm on 12. Dang it. Another one. Man. Hmm, I'm afraid there's no more time. I'm gonna play a time walk and I'm gonna play a contract from below. Cards to discard. Okay, yeah. Uh, come on, computer, you can do it. Swamp edit. Ooh, a Dredge Skeleton that I can actually cast. That's kind of funny. Okay, sure. Then I'm gonna take my extra turn. Sweet. On the ground C, I could go Dark Ritual into Sengir, or I could just go Wall of Air in the next turn. I could do that. I could maybe even first attack, see what he does. Okay, I'm not gonna block, fair enough. Then I play Wall of Air, and then I'm gonna pass. That was good. So my 1-5 blocker is gonna stop those wolves. Ooh, I clicked too quickly. Um, second main, let's see. Mistress, factory. Yeah, sing your vampire. Pass the time. I now have a dark ritual, or sorry, control magic as well, if you play something good. Okay, let's go factory, first attack with the sing gear. See what he does. 
the scepter falcon that's it pass the turn okay 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 i think i'm gonna steal this this one island shall we steal it is that mean yes so we're gonna do it <laughs> take it take your timber wolf great and now we're gonna attack This is going very, very well. Look at him here, charm blocking, counter on the vampire. Love it, love it, love it. So it's now a 5-5. Five, five. That is so sweet. I mean, he's in serious trouble. A drain life as well. Okay, so I can just attack. Let me think about this. Um... Let's ban these two together. Why not? Because, you know, it's funny. I can do it. Attack. He's going to chump. Okay, he's going to take six. Timberwolves. Okay, just assign the one point of damage. Now, I think I can win it. Let's play Dark Ritual. Let's play Drain Life. One. Two. Three, four, done, target, Tusk Guardian. And enter, and another enter, and another enter. Hey, we're finally there. Yay, got the cards. Take the cards, take the cards. One, an amulet as well, that's sweet. Which of these spells has a power of two? Is that Wall of Air, Brothers of Fire, Personal Incarnation, Phantasmal Forces, or Bull Lightning? That is Brothers of Fire. Hey, found a crusade. Another ank. Wow, I could like, where am I actually? I need to hurry up. Oh, I'm just getting away from my target. I need to go to Eleanor Hall and then on one way up. Crusader attacking the Haven. Where's the Haven? Shamal Haven or something. Oh, it's all the way over there. I have no idea what I have no idea where that is, but I, I okay, I'm just gonna attack that wizard. Gonna be focused. Ten food for twenty golds. Nothing here. Let's let's see if I can sell something again. Look, I got a lot of white cards again. Sell for 240, sell for 180, sell for 50, sell for 95. Let's just sell two, I don't care, boom. White cards, who needs white cards? Leave the village, and onwards we go, my man. Onwards we go, on the quest, we're on the quest. Did I see a dungeon there? Hey, a hint, if you combine the circle of protection green with hurricane, ooh, yeah, you can prevent the damage from the hurricane, and you can, you know, your opponent does take the damage. That's pretty sweet. But we're not going to do it. We're not going to do it. I'm going to stay focused. I'm not going to go into, into the dungeon. No, stop! Uh, dude. <sighs> Seriously, I just want to go into the White Castle. At least I get to start. Play first. Play first, muchacho. Mm. What do we got? We got a swamp, underground sea swamp, a greed, drain life, time walk again. Oh, I love it. I love these two time walks in my deck. It's just so ridiculous. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is maybe next turn, dark ritual drain life. Is that something I could do? Oh, no, I'm not. Now I've got the Sengir, so I'm just gonna wait until I can play Sengir. And then play a time walk at the right time so I can hit him twice, like hit him for eight, for example. Ooh, he's discarding cards. Awesome. Um, Island. Dark Ritual. I love this Dark Ritual into Sengir Vampire. I, I really now want to make my mono black deck again and just do that. Dark Ritual into Sengir feels so good. It feels like it's meant to be. I know a lot of people say Dark Ritual into Hippie, but I'm kind of liking this Dark Ritual Sengir stuff. But, you know, maybe it's just me. 
Um, I'm first going to play Greed. I'm not going to play the Time Walk yet. I hope I'm not going to regret it, because it could have, of course, attacked him twice now with the Time Walk, but... Okay, Raise Dead. That's pretty cool. Who plays a Raise Dead? Oh, Paralyze. That is, that is not cool. That is not cool. I am going to untap it, though. That is not cool. Um, let's use the Greed. Take some damage for a card. Let's attack. I mean, next turn I can end and tap the Sengir and play Time Walk, so... It's not that bad. Paralyze, you know, the good thing about Paralyze is, especially early in the game... Ooh, look at that, casting Escape Zombies. That, you know, you're, you have to choose, am I going to untap my creature or am I actually going to do something else with my turn? In this case, I'm going to untap my creature. Okay, so I've got an island left. Going to play a swamp. First going to attack. You know what? I'm going to be patient with my time walk. And I'll tell you why. Because I think next turn, you know, he, he thinks that he has one more turn after that. You know what I mean? So I want to surprise him. And when I play the time walk, I want to win with it straight away. So I'm just going to draw an extra card. I'm going to pass a turn. I know that he can attack me now. Put me on eight, which is which is a little bit low, but you know I'm feeling good. I feel confident. I also have to drain life, by the way. Maybe I should have played it. Oh, drain life! Oh God, yeah, this is getting a little bit too close to home, to be honest. But I still feel good, though. I still feel that I'm in a driver's seat, to be honest. Um, let's go island. Let's first attack. First attack. Then he's gonna go to five, then we're gonna time walk, right? I could go and then also play a greed. That would I'm not gonna I'm not gonna cast a greed. I think it's too greedy. I'm not gonna do it. Um yeah, let's untap. I'm really annoyed by the fact that I'm just not going to kill him. I could keep keep it untapped. Maybe that's not a bad idea. I've got a swamp. I've got a swamp. Then again, I do have a counter spell. So if he does something weird, I can counter it away. Yeah, let's just attack. Put him on one, pass turn, and then hopefully I can counter away whatever he does and, and, and win the game. Zombie Master, actually, I'm not too worried about that. You know, I can go to four. Let's untap. I mean, I can also drain him, of course, for one, but it's more fun to kill him with the same gear, I feel. Hey, there we go. Is this the White Castle? Sweet. Duel the Priestess. Ah, this is so annoying. So many games I have to play, and you know, especially that last game, you don't even get any anti cards. Feels bad. Okay, I've got a Tim, I've got a Greed again, the Island, the Mahamoti, the Counterspell, the Time Walk, and another, and a Factory. So I think I'm gonna start with. The island, and the reason is the counter spell. If I draw an island next, I have counter magic up. So we're going to play a little bit slower, I guess. I could have gone for a factory next turn, animate factory attack, but yeah, going for the island here. Okay, I've got a swamp. Again, the time walk. I love, I have, I mean, I only play with two time walks, but every time it's in my hand, that's awesome. I could go time walk Tim. But I'm going to keep the time walk for a later moment in the game. What I also love to do is, um, you know, see if you can get like some big flyers and then play the time walk. Just like I did in the, in the previous game, actually. Okay, we got a swamp. This is good. We got some mana going. Next turn, I can play a greed, which is nice. Like, she's really not going to like a greed. Oh, I was, I was thinking of... Um, 
of the other card instead of greed. A uh, gloom, I was thinking of gloom, but of course this is greed. Maybe I'm gonna take greed out of my deck. I'm not really that happy with greed, to be honest. It's a good card though, but I don't know. Would you play with greed and also considering in this game? I mean, life is quite valuable. Then again, I do like the synergy in the deck with greed and drain life. I don't, yeah, I don't know. Greed in a deck with spirit leaves, that's kind of cool as well. Like white, black. Of course, a wall of swords, of course, and I cannot counter. Um, and I forgot to ping. What else could go wrong? Well, let's pass as a turn. I don't have double blue anyway. Yeah, of course, kill it. Kill it, gain some life. Kill it. <sighs> Annoying. If I can just find that Mahamothi, you know what? Let's first just start pinging on a 10 turn clock. Got the drudge. I'm gonna use greed. Another Tim, that is actually not too bad. I'm gonna use greed again. Because I'm greedy. Hey, City of Brass, that is actually pretty good because with City of Brass, I can cast uh, Mahamoti next turn. That is really nice. So I guess greed also gets better if your opponent is playing with Swords to Plowshares. It's the same thing as what you see a lot in old school is players playing with Sylvan Library and then you know people play, uh, play Swords against them. It's always nice. Oh, I forgot to ping again. God, I need to remember this pinging stuff. I'm talking too much. I got to focus more. Mahamoti Jin, baby. Next turn. Okay, this is the plan. Ping him for two, put him on eight. Attack with the Modi. He's probably going to block with the Wall of Swords. Play Time Walk, attack again, ping him again, and I think then he's dead. Is he dead then? Maybe not. But anyway, he's close to being dead. Okay, now remember to ping. Got to put him on nine here. Do you have any fast effects, ah? Yes, I do in your end step. Absolutely, I do. Boom, boom. Put you on nine. Put you on nine, fool. Okay. Hey, I've got the gloom. That's funny. A little bit too late to the party, though. I'm going to attack here with the Mamoti. Hey, there we go. Play the time walk. If it, 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 it's just a special feeling when you're playing with two time walks in your deck. I can't describe it, but it's great. Um, yeah, let's take the extra turn. We're going to ping him to death. We're going to do what we like to do the most. Bye, bye, bye. It was fun. Hey, I got some cards. That is pretty sweet. You know what? I'm going to jump into the castle. Who dares to challenge the mighty white wizard? Are you brave enough to enter my castle? Would be so funny to now say, well, no, not really. <laughs> not really. Of course I'm going to enter your castle, man. A castle in effect in the castle. That's funny. I'm going to, I'm going to kick your ass or try to. I also love these like cat, uh, castle dungeon sound effects. I mean, these games are like seriously good games. Um, you know what? I'm first going to check out these because there's new in there. Okay. I get an extra life. You know what? We're going to do the questions because we, 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 we like it. Uh, which of these spells requires one black and two colorless mana to cast? The Sorcerer's Queen, the Plague Rats, the Junin Ifrit, a Spirit Shackle, or Cursed Land. I think Sorcerer's Queen is two black and one. Maybe the Plague Rats. Junin Ifrit is also two black and one, right? Spirit Shackle is two black, Cursed Land. One black or was Cursed Land the other one? I think Plague Rats. Yay! Funny, by the way, that they're asking um, a question about a black card in the white castle. And what is this white mage testing? But this is, it's looking kind of tough 
I mean, what will you do here? I guess I'm going to fight a Tusk Guardian, but I'm going to fight this dude. I'm going to go for that Tusk Guardian. I got the feeling it's somewhere here. I got a feeling. A Tusk Guardian with a castle in play. Okay. Play first. Let's start the duel. So what am I working with? I've got a counter spell, a swamp, a drain life, a dark ritual, a city of brass, island control magic. That's actually pretty good. That is not too bad. Um, I'm going to start with island. Pass the turn. Next turn, city of brass. I have counter magic up. Hopefully I can draw into like a Sangir, get a Sangir out early. Let's see, so I can place, okay, second island for counter magic is pretty good. Let's just hold, exactly, just the one attack, that's, that's fine. As long as he doesn't have like the pump spells, like the holy strength and stuff and the crusades. Hey, birds of paradise. Should I kill the Birds of Paradise? You know what? I'm going to play a Tim. Actually, I cannot, because I thought maybe I can drain it with a drain life, but it, of course, has the bonus from the from the castle. So that is not an option. Passing the turn. Sure, man, attack next turn. Next turn, I'm going to ping it down. Wop, wop, ping it down, baby. Black mana. Ooh, that's big. Maybe I should steal the war mana. Think, should I steal the War Mammoth? Yeah, I want, you know what? I'm first gonna ping this away. Then I'm gonna steal the Mammoth. I probably, by the way, oh man, was this already a misplay? I should have probably killed the Birds of Paradise because that's, that's more dangerous actually. That would have been better. <clears throat> Sometimes I do something and while I do it, I realize it's the wrong thing to do. I don't know if you recognize that as a Magic player. Because look, now we can cast another mana. It's not the it's not the end of the world, but let's just kill the bird before I forget. Kill the bird, and yeah, I cannot really attack because of that castle. Mm. I'm actually pretty low on mana. So is my opponent. Oh, of course. This is so annoying. Um, I think I'm going to take the damage because, yeah. And then next turn I can block and kill him with the two Tims, I think. Ooh, a giant growth, of course. Yeah, put me on 10. Oh, man, that's bad. That is not good. I was so happy with myself. Um, Shall I play a weakness on the dude? Why not? Let's go weakness. Now he's got four toughness, and I'm not going to attack with the Mammoth. I'm just going to take it easy, you know. Okay, he's not doing anything. That means I can double Tim. Double Tim to Tusk. A contract from below. That is pretty sweet. Uh, let's go this one, one, and one. Okay, sure, yeah, play a Berserk, okay. Um, so it's a 6-3, so I could attack with it, but then it dies. Um, no, thank you, I'm fine. If I don't attack, I think, exactly, it's not gonna die, right, if I don't attack. Okay, take on my turn, I mean, things are, things are looking pretty good. Hey, there's another island. I could do Dark Ritual Drain Life, play Contract. I mean, it's kind of fun. Or just play Contract. Um, I think I'm going to Drain Life. Also because, let's see, Drain Life. Um, Okay, so I can do Drain Life for three. Shall I kill the birds? No, I'm gonna drain, I'm gonna drain them. Drain them. 
I mean, I got counter magic open, so if he plays something really good, I can counter it away. Pass the turn, people. Nothing to see here. Another force? I mean, I'm... Is he gonna play like Force of Nature or something? It's, it's just being on. The teams are doing a lot of work this game. I like it. Factory, and now it's very tempting, right, to play the contract, but I, I'm in the White Castle. I gotta be a pro. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I think next turn I could win, I think. Ooh, Control Magic. And a Desert Twister. What is he doing here? Oh, he's Desert Twistering to Control Magic. Wow, that took a moment. Okay, countering that. Sorry, guys, it took a moment. I was like, is he playing both spells or is he, what's he doing? Okay. I'm gonna take my turn. He is on three. Oh, and unsummon. wow. <coughs> that makes it much easier. Simplifies my life. Let's also animate this, you know, we're just gonna go safety, safety first. We're in the castle, we gotta be like pros. Assembly worker, war mammoth, and a drudge. Attack. Okay, winning this one. A question. What special ability does the wall of spears have? Um, first strike, right? It's a wall. Yeah, first strike. It's from antiquities. So this is always kind of like sucky when you don't see any dice. I feel like I gotta attack this Archangel because then after. But Archangel is good. I'm gonna do it. Archangel has a mega Pegasus and a castle. Oh man, that is rough. She also won the toss. Oh, this is rough. This is rough. Mm, oh, but she lets me start. Okay, that's nice. But look at my hand. Two Dark Rituals and Lance. That is not good. That is not great. Let me find a Sengir, please. Okay, Psionic Blast. Not too shabby. But, I mean, if he animates Factory... Oh, look at this. Okay, yeah. Now, it's, now it gets kind of interesting. Hope, or hopefully, but there could be a situation where... She's gonna use Mana Vault to cast the... Okay. She seems a little confused. I want to say to cast a Sarah Angel, but she's not doing that. Island, I guess I could play Drudge, and then, yeah, I could play Drudge, block the Onolet with the Drudge. The problem is that Pegasus, you know, it's so annoying when they start with the Flyer. It's such good evasion. Oh, I, come on. Get out of here. At least, at least she does it the wrong way. They don't take extra damage, but this is bad news. Um, look at what I'm drawing. Like, it's complete utter crap. It's like island, 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 swamp, whatever. Wow. Wow, look at her attack. You know what? I'm going to kill the assembly worker. Because the assembly worker is a land and she's kind of low on land. Oh, not more lands. God, no. Oh, no. This is what I hate. When you got to play Time Walk kind of as a card to cycle. I mean, this is really nasty, but I got to do it. Hey, contract from below. Okay, okay. This has got to be my big turn. Okay, I'm going to take a bit of a risk here, but I think it's going to be fine. So, Dark Ritual, Dark Ritual. Contract from below. Hey, okay. Oh, I got my Moti. Sweet Papa Moti. Uh, I got to play it, obviously. Um, is it going to save me? I don't think so, but... It's better than nothing. Oh, this is so funny. So I've got another contract. Shall I play another contract? I mean, it's risky, but you know what? I'm going to play another contract because I feel like I'm going to 
with this hand, I'm not gonna win it, so. Oh, control magic edit. Oh, look at this, wall of air. That is a great blocker. Oh man, this is super cool. Oh yeah. Contract from below really, really, really saved my ass here. I was so dying. I was so dead. I was so incredibly dead. And look at me now. Back in it. Um, let's attack first with the Modi. Gonna play the Sengir. One, two, three, four, and five. I'm gonna keep counter magic up, and then next turn I'm also gonna drain life, I think. Oh, Wrath of God! Okay, I can counter it. Yeah, counter spell. Ooh. That counter spell was much, much needed. Okay, um, I'm gonna drain, I think. One, one. I can drain a total for three. Um, you know, I think I'm gonna drain the Pegasus actually, because then I can attack him. Yeah, let's do that, why not? Drain the Pegasus. Done. And let's attack, put him on one. Okay, and then shall I play the Tim? Why not? Gonna play the Tim. I mean, if he has, hey, of course he dies on the on the mana vault. I want to say if he has or if she has a Wrath, that would have been a bit problematic. But hey, uh, what is the toughness of the Junin Efreet? Junin Efreet. Uh, is it three? Yeah, it is. Okay, three, three flyer. Mmm, man. Where is that wizard hiding? Where is that wizard hiding? Am I in the wrong area? Let's go. Oh, I feel really good after that victory against uh, the angel. Let's play first. Contract from below is so broken. Talking about it, it's in my hand again. Look at that. Contract from below, contract from below, island, counterspell, swamp, Sengir, drain life. Go island, pass turn. I really want to beat the white mage. I know this episode is taking longer than 45 minutes, by the way. I'm sorry for that, but i got to continue now. I feel like I've committed here. Let's play a swamps. Uh, shall I play a contract? I'm going to play a contract. Who cares? Okay. I've got Island, Swamp, Timmy, City of Brass, Gloom, Swamp, Time Walk. Okay. There's a Tusk. Mm -hmm. What to do? I think I could do Time Walk and then I can play a Gloom. Uh, I also could do Tim. Gloom is three. Interesting. I'm still on 14. You know what? I'm going to play the Gloom. Putting me on 12. Um, let's play the 10. He's gonna attack me again with the lions, gonna put me on 10, I guess. Oh, force of nature, that is bad. That is bad news. Mm. How much is the force for casting? Four mana, and oh, four forests. Oh, look at this, I'm gonna time walk. And I'm going to take the extra turn. Oh, it's not ideal though. Not ideal at all. But I can kill the birds. 
I mean, I can kill the birds. The problem is, he can still attack with the force. He can hit me for 10. Oh, God. Oh, this is so bad. We'll be on two. But I need to, I need to do it because he'll take eight. Yeah, I got to do it. I think this is because my plan here is he's going to take eight damage, going to drop to six. He's going to attack me, hopefully just for 10. I'll be on two. Then the next turn, he'll take eight again. Exactly. He doesn't have enough mana. Okay. So, uh, no giant growth. No giant growth. No. Okay. No giant growth. That's good. I'm just going to pass the turn. Hopefully, he's going to take eight. I just really want to beat this, this wizard. Yes, he takes the damage. Okay, that's great. Awesome. Man, how much how many of these dudes do I have to beat? This is insane. I do want to take the gold in there. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna duel him. Yeah, it starts with a war elephant in play. Why not? Crazy. Oh man. What do I have? Counter spell, swamp, time walk, factory, dark ritual, contract from below. That's good. I think I'm just going to do swamp contract unless I really find like a good card because I do have time walk in hand. Ooh, there's an island. Yeah, that is. I'm going to do island. Yeah, I'm just going to take two more. I'm going to drop to 12, whatever. I mean, next turn. Oh, man. Can we stop attacking me, please? It really hurts. I'm on 11 already. So, it's so difficult to play against an opponent that starts with a creature. Oh, uh, let's go Swamp. I think I'm just going to do Time Walk now. Oh, I could do Dark Ritual. Does that make sense, though? Oh, let me think. If I do Dark Ritual, I could do Time Walk and I can play Contract in the same turn. That's what I'm going to do. Dark Ritual. Time Walk. Contract from below. Come on, computer, you can do it. Yeah, sometimes the computer is a little bit wonky with the contract from below. Oh, a Sengir edit. I don't want to lose a Sengir. Okay, so I've got another Dark Ritual I could cast, but I don't want to do it. So I'm going to take a damage, but I get my extra turn, which is sweet. Hey, another time walk. Perfect. Um... I should have played an underground C here. That was stupid. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm gonna take another turn. Because then I've got four mana. I could play the ghost ship and I can at least block the war elephant. Because I don't really want to steal the war elephant, to be honest. Passing the turn. Ah, oh, that's that. That's kind of annoying. That's I didn't see that coming. That is annoying. Sorts of plowshares on the ship. Next turn, I can play Water Elemental. I mean, it's a five four. That's really big. Swamp and look at that. I've got two Control Magics. So that is kind of sweet. C O P Black. Okay. Whatever, man. Okay, so I'm going to do Control Magic on the War Elephant. And I'm going to attack. There we go. That's it. Taking the damage. Taking the hits. I can smell the treasure. Ooh, Karma. That is not good. That is not good. I've got two, three swamps. I'm going to take three damage from the Karma, I believe. Oh, I've got even force. Oh, this is, oh no, that karma is going to kill me. I was kind of relaxed, but now that I see that karma, oh no, karma's going to kill me. 
I thought I, 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 oh, I have so many swamps here. I should have said that I could smell the gold because then, you know, uh, that was the start of the end, that, that comment. This is not good. Oh, I don't want to click on the karma. I don't want to click on the karma. Dead. I lost the gloom. God, I'm booted out. That's not cool. Um, let's go to the village. Trade black amulets for green cards. I don't really need that. Um, do I want these cards? Paralyze is kind of good. I can buy Paralyze. Um, man, I have to admit, I'm a, li I'm a little down here for getting kicked out of the White Castle. I thought we were doing a great job, to be honest. Um, let's check in my deck. Should I play the Ashes to Ashes? Maybe I should. It's really good. Hmm, 58 cards. I've got another contract from below I could play. Another counter spell I could play. I feel that I also need like some more... Hmm. I feel like I need like some more creatures in the deck. We got two vampire bats. That's pretty good. Let's see. What do what do I actually have? First, the mana base. 18, 19, 22, 24 mana. I think that's okay. That's kind of what you need. A falcon, water elemental, wall of air, a tim, a mamoti, a ghost ship. So it's kind of a lot of creatures actually. One, two, three, six, eight, nine creatures, twelve. 14. Yeah, I mean, you need you need a lot of creatures in this game, I feel. Um, I'm going to take out the greed. I think the greed's not really going to take out the weakness as well. Okay. You know what we're going to do? I'm going to save it here. I don't want to because I want to really go back into that white castle, but I feel we got to save it here. We got to respect what happened um, and maybe I gotta rethink my deck maybe going into the White Castle with black cards since you're gonna play against Karma maybe that's a mistake I'm gonna you know what I'm gonna think about it because <laughs> that's what I do in my spare time I think about Chandelar why not the life I lead quite interesting anyway um, I've saved the game and uh, thank you for watching another episode right here on Timmy Talks Please remember to like, uh, leave a comment, maybe even share it on your socials. All these things really help the channel move forward. And I look forward to see you guys next week, Sunday. Uh, take care. And I look, uh, like I said, man, see you, uh, see you Sunday. Cheers. Oh, man, that white, that white wizard, that white wizard. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Somebody can see.